WTFNN. Headline news update. Good morning, everybody. I'm Tommy O'Brien coming to you live from TFNN headquarters in St. Petersburg, Florida. It's Friday, July 5th, 10 a.m. Eastern Time, 30 minutes into the trading day. Hope everyone had a great July 4th. Back into a full day of trading action today. And we got some news as we got non-farm payrolls coming in at 224,000, beating expectations. That at 830, we have markets pulling back a bit. The Dow, negative 151 points, trading 26,814. S&P is currently negative by 21, trading at 29.74. NASDAQ negative by 63 points, trading at 81.06. As we start things off this morning, we're going to take a look at the VIX for the volatility index hitting a 12 handle last, uh, I was going to say last week. This feels like a Monday, but this week, earlier this week, getting a 12 handle briefly, the VIX with some negative market action, 13.66 this morning, still relatively low volatility priced into that market. We'll jump over to the futures markets. We'll start it off with the Dow, and it's been a downtrend since overnight. We were sitting there on the Dow, 27,000 on the dot for most of the overnight session. About 2 a.m., we start trading lower. 8.30 a.m., we get that jobs number. There's your jobs number volatility coming in, and we've, we're down about 120 Dow points, even just from 8.30 this morning. NASDAQ 100, much the same. There's your 8.30 volatility on the jobs number. We spike lower, 78.09. S&Ps, similar as well, currently trading at 29.77. We were up there approaching 3,003. So you're talking about a solid 26 points below that level. Crude oil, volatility as well, traded higher from about 8.30 until just recently we made that high, 57.71. Gold contract reacting to that jobs number as well. Pretty substantial. From 1416, we're now trading at 1391. And we've had some dollar strength, euro weakness. We got the euro trading at 11220. The other chart to take a look at here is we have a little bit of a higher rate coming at us on that number. There's your 10 year yield. And you can see, even uh, zooming in a bit, there's 8 a.m. this morning. We we're trading at 1.96. You got the 10 year now trading at 2.05%. In terms of other news out there, what you have moving the markets, the chip sector getting hit this morning as you have Samsung hinting that they are going to pull back second quarter profit likely fell 56%. And just to jump around, that is hitting the chips with Micron down about 7 tenths, Adobe down 1.3 as well. Stay tuned, folks. Come back at 10 o'clock with man Basil Chapman, live programming all day, all Friday at TFNN. Have a great day.